Hey everyone, how you doing? I'm just sitting out today, relaxing on this somewhat warm winter afternoon here in Quebec, Canada. And I thought I'd do a quick video. And I don't know exactly what I'm going to talk about, but gee, it's a great day today to be sober. It really, really is. If you can take a second, can you please subscribe to my channel? And can you take another second and hit that like button? I'd really appreciate it. And again, thanks a lot for stopping by. I just wanted to make a quick video today. I'm just sitting at my off the grid cottage. No one's around, it's winter. My sweetheart and I are the pretty well the only ones up here. In the winter, no one really want, wants to come up, you know, cause it's cold and that, and we love it. You know, we love it. Rain, shine, snow, whatever it is, we're here all the time as much as we can. But today, I just wanna share with you something that I adopted in early sobriety, and it's helped me a lot. And what it is, it's very, you know, it's, it's very simple, but it's hard to do, but if you do it, It'll have a big impact on your sobriety one day at a time it really will it'll improve your sobriety and also improve your life in general because we'll improve we'll feel better about ourselves so our life in general will get better people places and things will also notice the change believe it or not and what it is if you're willing to do the hard things in your sobriety the things that need to be done a fourth and a fifth and an eight and a nine all the steps in your recovery. You're willing to clean up your side of the street, do what needs to be done for you are a better person. So you feel better about yourself. So your self-esteem comes up, your self-worth is comes up. You value yourself. You help other people. You do with the things that need to be done. Your sobriety, your life will get better. Guarantee it if you do the hard things in your life. If you're like me, the first two years of my sobriety and do the easy things, your sobriety, your life will more likely be the exactly the same as my life and be miserable. If we do the easy things, the things we are, we need to know, we need to, that we need to be done and we know they need to be done, but we don't want to do it. We don't want to get off our duff for whatever reasons. We just don't want to do it. Your sobriety will be crummy. It really, really will. You will not weep the benefits of sobriety. You won't, because you know why? Because I know it. That's the way I lived for the first two years of my sobriety or my journey of recovery. Not willing to do anything. Just thinking that putting a plug on the jug was enough. That's all I needed to do to have sobriety and my life would change. Well, that's BS. So one day, when I just about had a nervous breakdown, I said to myself, you know, Terry G, you will, do, you need to do everything and anything to get yourself in order, to feel better, because what you're doing is not working. So I got myself a sponsor. I got active in recovery. I started to do my steps. I started to take responsibility for my life and the decisions I was making in my life. I got a job. I started listening to other people. I went back in counseling. I did all the things that I was afraid to do, that I didn't want to do. I did that. I got active. I got involved. And I got involved in my children's life. I got involved in life. And I started to clean up my side of the street. And life got better. My sobriety got better. So my life in general got much better too. People, places, and things started to notice the improvement in Terry G, but it took a little while, but I was willing to do the hard stuff. And if you're willing to do the hard stuff, go back in your childhood, work out those problems, work out that trauma, do those things. You will feel better about yourself and your recovery will blossom, be leaps and bounds. You will have contented in sobriety. So when those storms of life come up, you won't be so emotional. You won't take it so hard. You'll have be well grounded and you feel good in your own skin. Don't be like me and do the easier way for the first couple of years of sobriety and drive yourself kooky. Do what needs to be done and you will feel better. Guarantee it. Start your year off with that. Take one thing in your life that you find hard to do or you know, you know that needs to be done and just work on that and you'll see, you'll reap the benefits of doing that. We all need to do it. Being an alcoholic did not make us a saint. Believe me, it made us a bunch of devils and we'll never be as clean as, as you can see, snow, <laughs> but 
we can sure do a lot to improve our life. We, we really can, okay? My name is Terry G. This is an alcohol-free life channel where we learn to live sober one day at a time. If you can take a second, can you please subscribe to my channel, take another second, and hit that like button. I'd really appreciate it. Just remember, together we can stay sober. Together we are stronger. We really are. God bless. Stay sober. I'll see you next time. Ciao for now. Bye-bye.